Um, my biggest priority is getting the fun round nine grant signed up and running. And hopefully we'll have a quarter one this year so that we have quarter one results. Um, the biggest, well, the vision of success so the, the biggest issue is uh, building the team right now. We don't have any funding, we don't have any staff, but we've got a lot of work even before we sign the grant just to get through the LFA process. Um, we have two SRs, we have lots of SSRs who all need capacity built. Um, so how are we gonna manage that um, going forward? How are we gonna recruit and staff up and keep our eye on the mark? Um, vision of success is a unified, coordinated partnership to successfully manage the program going forward and deliver timely, good quality results. Um, obviously, shorter term, that assumes the grant is signed, but um, you know, my job is secured <laughs> in that role. Um, systems are in place, staff are hired and in place, um, and we're actively and successfully building SR capacity. Um, Causes, key causes, no funding yet, so competing priorities, lots of noise for everybody. Um, lines of authority aren't necessarily clear. At the partnership level, there are issues about shared vision. Um, the organization, our key SR, is very technical but not managerial, and yet they're stepping into a managerial role. We're very managerial, but yet our systems aren't really in place to manage such a large grant. Um, at the team level, we really need to hire, we have the high potential for good capacity people in Nepal. Um, we just need to make sure we get those people and develop the systems so that it operates smoothly. Um, intervention, I, Monday I need to plan a trip to Lucknow to start talking through some of these issues with our partner. Um, we need to establish working groups to get some of the systems in place before we sign, um, working with our m and &E team and our program team, stealing their time, getting them developing tools and formats um, so that we're up and running. <coughs> um, I need to finalize the pre-award funding proposal. You'll be hearing from me soon, Brian. <laughs> And we need to get a detailed work plan in place um, as we move forward with clarified roles and responsibilities and timelines and yeah, all, that fun stuff. all that fun stuff. All that, yeah. So metrics, grant signs, staff hire, contracts in place, happy. all those. <laughs> Everybody happy? <laughs> Increased sense of trust. I'm working on my multi-item scale. <laughs> Find the two MSM in Nepal. Yeah. <laughs> Who have malaria? <laughs> <laughs> that would be a bonus. Habib in Myanmar is very, very respected, and he he's actually doing uh, much the same as I think you've planned. I just wondered if he was on your radar, whether you've touched base with him and... Uh, he's, a, he's on my radar. I know him from previous life. Okay. Um, and I need to come to Myanmar and visit. Okay. Because I think he <coughs> can jump on your bus. He can learn from you and you can learn from him. I think yeah. it's, it's a The thing is, our SR has really strong technical capacity. Uh -huh. um, it's really getting the systems in place that they can manage and really the organization isn't I mean, the grant isn't about, um, it's about community-based organization strengthening. Yeah. So it's really improving CBOs to deliver um, rather than actually delivering. And, and Habibi is actually doing that, as he was oh, saying. He is, okay. he, he's get, I think he gets the same outputs from, as he said on Friday, same outputs from CBOs as the, the places that he manages. At I think a quarter of the cost, um, so he's playing, he's, he's playing with the CBO model as well, okay. and trying to improve their capacity. I know not so much about it. Key Jane or Mark, do you know anything? How it would dovetail with your expert? No, I'm reading as well. I to be honest, it's a bit opaque. Yeah. Maybe yeah. as well. I mean, all of the BIC finances are consolidated into the head office. 
Is that good or bad? Do they hate each other? Do they hate each other and have cat fights? No, they they like actually they've done an evaluation of the Myanmar platform as well. So there's this yeah. How will you know if you have a shared vision? Well that gets to the multi item scale. (laughs) I think um I think a reduction in questionable requests by email, uh, those kind of things, uh, timely reporting, um, clear lines of communication and clear communication. Um, but it's true, it's a tricky one to um, measure. Great, thank you. Thank you. Folks, it's been a pleasure.